Hi. Recently, I met an entrepreneur who was asking me on what basis he should be prioritizing his cash outflows. And I thought that makes a great finance mantra for this week. And so here I am talking to you about the prioritization of your cash outflow. So as usual, I'm coming up with an acronym. Guess what it is? Bling. Yeah. So B stands for your business operational expenses. So the first, you allocate your cash that you have towards all your business operational expenses. It could be your material cost, your uh, salaries, so on and so forth. L stands for the legal and the compliance costs. So ensure that you have enough money to pay your income taxes, your GST and other legal costs that you would be incurring for your business. I stands for investments. Uh, investments could be, um, you know, in, uh, in the stock market, it could be in the form of mutual funds or it could be property, so on and so forth, so that your business is self-sufficient and it has something to rely upon. N stands for necessary reserves, especially your cash reserves, so that if there is an emergency, you know you have something to fall back on. When I say reserves, it doesn't mean you have to stock up all the extra amount that you have as a reserve. You just need to create the right amount of reserve that's required for the business in line with your business operational requirements. And G is your generic expenses. All the other expenses that your business requires to grow, to sustain, to operate. It could also be like donations in the form of CSR or any luxurious expenses over and above the amount that you've set aside for the important aspects of the business. So with that, I'd like you to have your business, I'd like your business to be, to go bling and um, get the most out of it. So how are you prioritizing your cash outflow? Do let me know in the comments below, like, share, comment, subscribe, and the bell icon. Catch you soon yet again in another Finance Mantra. Until later, ciao from me, Sangeeta, bye.